I like it too, baby. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, cats, dogs, and frogs, my name is Darius P, and welcome back to another MK11 combo tutorial. And this one, we rocking with the custom variation of rain, and you will need the moves water ball and geyser palm in order to do this combo. Let's go crazy. We starting off with let's go crazy. The one through three looks just like that. Let's keep it moving. Okay, so after Let's Go Crazy, we're gonna hit him with the Geyser Palm, the down back one. And we are gonna amplify it, and since he isn't in the air, it's not gonna hit him, so let's practice going from Let's Go Crazy into Geyser Palm, and don't forget to amplify it. Looks just like that, I'm spamming that amplify button. Let's keep it moving. Okay, so after the guys at Palm, we're going to hit him with the Deadly Tsunami, the 242. Two. Looks just like that, and we can't practice going from the guys at Palm and to the Deadly Tsunami. I guess you can practice the inputs, right? The inputs would be like that, so we got to practice going from Let's Go Crazy to the guys at Palm all the way down to Deadly Tsunami. Let's do this. Looks just like that. Let's look at that one more time. Now, let's keep it moving. Okay, so after Day Lucy Name, we're gonna hit him with the water ball. This move is actually absolutely beautiful. So what we're gonna do is, well, let me take this amplifier off. I can take this amplifier off because we're gonna amplify, right? And then we're gonna hold down. See, if you don't amplify it, it just hit him with the ball, right? But if you amplify it, it holds them. And you can control, like we wanna hold down so it bounces them, right? If you hold down, it bounces them. Just like that, and then we can continue the combo. Right, so let's practice going from the Daily Tsunami into the Water Ball. Okay, and after you amplify, you don't have to hold the amplify button any longer. Now you could end it like that, but we gotta practice going from let's go crazy all the way down into the water ball. Let's do this. Ooh, looks just like that. Let's look at that one more time. Now, you could end it with the uppercut. They both do around the same amount of damage, so you could be safe and end it with the uppercut right there. With all of my beasts out there, let's keep it moving. Now, we're going to end this combo off with the Prince of Pain. The forward to grab. That's your grab button, by the way. You could do a uh, three plus, no, one plus three. But... Also, you can just use the grab button, so I'm going to use both. See, that's the uh, one plus three, or I, I just use my grab button. Now, on this move, you want to press the four or the B or the circle if you're playing on PlayStation. You want to press it when he swipes back towards you. So, watch this. See when he swipes back? Uh, stay up, uh, swipe, uh. That's when you press the well, that's when I press, or you can just spam it. You can just spam it like that. That also works. Now let's practice going from the water ball into the Prince of Pain. Looks just like that. Let's look at that one more time. Okay, now let's go from Deadly Tsunami all the way down to the Prince of Pain. Looks just like that. Let's look at that one more time. Okay, now let's go all the way from Let's Go Crazy to the Geyser Pump, to the Deadly Tsunami, to the Water Ball, and then we're going to finish it off with the Prince of Pain, let's do this.
looks just like that. As you can see, it did just a little bit more damage than if you would have ended like after the water ball. You end it with the uppercut. This does just a little bit more damage and it looks cooler also. Let's look at that one more time. My name is Darius P. Thanks for watching everybody. If you enjoyed the video and would like to watch another one right now, you can do so by clicking on any one of the four boxes that you see on your screen right now. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications by hitting that bell so you can be notified whenever I upload a new video.